Tonight, the future of our state and our republic will be decided. This is Commitment 2020, election night coverage on WDSU. Good evening to you. I'm Gina Swanson and I'm Stella Kim tonight. Of course, we are closely watching the presidential race along with the rest of the country and President Donald Trump has once again won in Mississippi with its six electoral votes. Neither President Trump nor former Vice President Joe Biden campaigned heavily in Mississippi. Another race we're watching closely at home Orleans District Attorney WDSU's Travers Mackle live tonight with a preview of two of the candidates, Arthur Hunter and Kiva Landrum Travers. That's right, Sella, both Hunter and Ladrum until recently were judges inside this building behind me, Orleans Parish Criminal Court, better known as Tulane and Broad. Now they are hoping to prosecute criminals inside this courthouse. Take a look at this. They were out campaigning today, waving signs, doing everything that they possibly could to get the vote out on the final day. They both feel confident. They both feel like they are uniquely qualified. They do understand that nobody may win this outright tonight, and it will go to a runoff. They are just hoping to get to that runoff. Sala, Gina, let's send it back to you all. All right, Travers, uh, thank you. Aubrey Killian also watching the Orleans District Attorney race. And tonight he is live covering the Jason Williams and Morris Reed campaigns. Aubrey. Hey, that's right. So first I want to show you we're at a polling spot here in Lakeview and we've seen actually quite a few more cars kind of trickling in at the last minute. Really in the past 20 or 30 minutes, we've seen a few more voters stopping by. So Morris Reed and Jason Williams, they are going to fight to be the city's top prosecutor. Jason Williams is the current city council president and a well-known defense attorney. So if elected, his focus is criminal justice reform. Morris Reed, he worked as a judge and was the head of the local NAACP. He says he is going to continue to fight for civil rights and criminal justice reform as well. Now, Jason Williams, he is set to hold a watch party tonight. I am told that starts at 8 o'clock. We are set to head on over there in just a little bit. So we're going to keep you posted all throughout the night. Back to you. All right, very important races that we are watching tonight. That's going to do it for us for right now. That's right. We'll see you back here in about 30 minutes. We are keeping tabs on some other races as well, including the national race, the congressional races, and some of the amendments. So you'll see the latest on WDSU.com and also on our WDSU mobile app. We'll see you in about 30 minutes, everyone. Back to NBC.